Hi, NBL fans. Well, the newest signing for the league, Cody Ellis, has hit town. He's in Sydney and he's getting ready for his first game in the NBL for the Sydney Kings. He's just got off a plane, Cody. You a little bit jet lagged? Or what's the condition? Yeah, pretty jet lagged. Um, you know, I think I'll want to fall asleep about four o'clock this afternoon. But uh, you know, I got to stay up, stay active, so uh, so I don't wake up at you know three in the morning. You haven't played a game for a fair while because of the college requirements over in the states. Uh, you must be. Jumping out of your skin to get out on the court again. Can't wait, can't wait. It's tough, uh, tough sitting there watching games, too, that much. What sort of condition have you arrived in? Because you haven't played for a while, but obviously the Kings would like to get you out on the court straight away. Uh -huh. I've been uh, training with the team over there, just couldn't play with them. So, uh, you know, it's not like I haven't done anything in the past six months. Um, so, yeah, I think I'll be ready to go. Four years in the college system playing hoops over there. Um, now you come into the NBL. Uh, what do you know about this league that, and, and what can you bring to it? Uh, well, I mean, it's changed so much, uh, you know, in just a small amount of time. Um, but, you know, I think being kind of a, a four man that can shoot it um, a bit, you know, I think I can, I can bring an extra element to the team, um, you know, being able to step out, spread the floor a bit, um, let AJ go to work inside a bit more. It was pretty competitive for your signature. You're from Perth. The mm -hmm. Wildcats wanted you desperately. Your dad's a legend of the club over there. Yep. Why Sydney? Um, well, a couple of reasons. Um, you know, Sydney was was fine with me being able to finish uh, finish my degree, um, which was big for me. And then, uh, you know, to play for a, a guy like Shane with his resume, you know, that opportunity doesn't come very often. Yeah, well, Shane Hill's the legend of the league. What What do you think that he can bring to your game? How can he help you develop as a baller? Um, well, I mean, he's been anywhere and everywhere, you know, with basketball and He's seen it all, done it all. So, uh, you know, with his knowledge, even being a, a point guard like he was, um, you know, he can he can help develop my game. He can show me what you know he wants he wants for me. You know how he wants me to develop. You know what he wants me to develop. Um, and you know, I think it's it's good for the whole team. Um, to try and get us to gel a bit. Perth won't like you being here. How do you feel about that? That's good. I love it. <laughs> <laughs> What's your dad think? Oh, he was. I mean, he was. He gave me a bit of grief um, when I first signed, but you know he's fine with it. End of the day, he said that uh, you know it's my decision, it's my career, so I can do you know what I want with it. We're sitting in the Sydney Entertainment Centre now. It's the home court of the Kings. Mm -hmm. You look around; it's empty. Can you can you visualise it full and chanting your name and hitting the winning shot? Oh, or something absolutely, like that? absolutely, that'd be great. But uh, yeah, I mean, I'm looking forward to to being here on the 29th when our first game is, um, and yeah, I'm looking forward to it sold out stadium and, and being loud and rowdy and you know getting behind us you're pretty active on social media we've noticed that you've been keeping a good eye on the kings obviously Absolutely. they've been your team for a while now uh -huh. before you get here yeah um what have you noticed about the team you're happy with how they're going yeah uh pretty happy with how they're going you know um obviously again it's tough sitting and watching you know halfway across the world knowing that you can't help help them out or anything like that um but, you know i think they're making the right steps and you know with with Shane and the, and the coaching staff that we have, I think that uh, we're in good hands. They had a bit of a shake-up with the imports recently. So Jesse Sanders left, Sam Young comes in, mm -hmm. huge name. Um, you would have known a fair bit about him, I yep. guess. Um, mm -hmm. What sort of impact did it make on on the basketball scene over in the States when his name was coming here? Um, it, it, was, it was pretty big. Um, you know, um, it's kind of not very often that you see an NBA guy come down um, and play down here, you know what I'm saying? Um, but, you know, I think it's good. It's good for the club. It's good for the league. You know, I think that the fact that we're starting to get some, you know, high name players down here uh, means it can kind of open up the scene to, to the rest of the world to know that, you know, we're here to play and, you know, we can play. What do you think when you get online and you go, wow, we've just signed Sam Young? It was pretty awesome, to be honest with you. Um, you know, high flying Sam Young. Um, but, yeah, I mean, I've I've seen him play, you know, for I mean all the teams he played for over in the, in the states, and uh, you know I've always, I've always liked his game, and it's going to be good uh, good to play with him. I think uh, you know he'll be able to definitely pass on knowledge that that could help me. Okay, um, you, your name's been thrown around for a few months now. Do you, is there any pressure like coming in, given that you, there's been a little bit of talk about you coming into this league? Um, a little bit. But, um, you know, once once you hit the court, you kind of forget about all that sort of stuff. You know, you kind of have that white line fever where as soon as you step across that line, it's you, the guys on the floor, and, you know, your teammates, and that's it. That's all that, you know, that you care about. Um, 
and uh, you know the crowd's an added bonus, obviously. Um, but yeah, I mean, now sitting sitting down thinking about it, you know, there's there's definitely that pressure, but you know, I don't think I'll let it get to me too much. Cody, it's great to have you in Australia. Great to have you part of the NBL final, and it, welcome man. aboard and play well. Thanks, buddy. Appreciate it.